We live in a galaxy teeming with wandering tiny worlds. It sounds almost like science fiction, doesn't it? A tiny world that formed around another star, visiting our cosmic neighborhood for us to study. And the frequency of these visitors has only been increasing as the years and decades pass. Just a couple of weeks ago, a strange comet believed to have come from interstellar space just made its latest dramatic swing around the Sun. An encounter that was imaged in mesmerizing detail by a space observatory. The origins of this new fellow on the block has puzzled scientists. It is a four-mile wide sun grazer object with a host of weird properties that suggest it may have been sent from another star system. For starters, its composition is extremely unique. It has no common materials usually found on a comet, nor does it possess the coma or the dusty tail of a comet. And, here's the most bizarre thing. It has an unnatural orbit that is strangely tilted, causing it to pass closer to our Sun than any other comet. Observations also revealed that the comet's colors appear similar to those of Oumuamua, which was the first unambiguous interstellar object ever seen in the solar system. All these features, among others, suggest that 96b may have been rerouted into our solar system by something which altered its natural trajectory. What is that something? Is this another mystery visitor that will remain a mystery like the Oumuamua? Is this an alien technology of artificial origin? Orbit Beyond the Blue Astronomers have spent decades looking for objects from outside our own solar system. What would essentially be interstellar visitors from an alien star system. But to no avail. But it is when all hope seems to be lost, that some of the most marvelous things happen. It was something like that for these astronomers. After decades of finding absolutely nothing, multiple objects are now arriving in our solar system. Scientists and astronomers from across the world, SETI, and even NASA have joined in the study of these mysterious visitors. What could we learn from them? What was their origin story? Where did they come from? And when could we expect the arrival of the next one? The mystery of 96B's origin is not the easiest to solve. Its angled orbit never takes it particularly close to Earth and its lack of activity makes it tricky to observe except when it's close to perihelion. Though space observatories such as SOHO can study it, many of the comet's secrets, including its origin, are still locked away. Something similar had happened with Oumuamua. It emerged from the celestial void and was visible only as a tiny bright speck on the telescope of a space observatory at Hawaii tumbling through space at 57,000 meters per hour. The object was found to have come from the direction of Vega, an alien star that resides 147 trillion miles away. It was shaped like an elongated cigar and was 1,000 meters long. That is not very big for a comet or asteroid, but that is, if it even was a comet or asteroid. It possibly formed into an uncannily spaceship-like disk and by the time it was spotted, it had already zipped by our own sun, performed a slick hairpin turn, and was hurtling off in another direction. A very unnatural movement and behavior for an asteroid or comet. Just as astronomers were recovering from the shock and awe and confusion of this surprise visitor to whom we'll get back in a moment, something else happened. There came another one. An engineer and amateur astronomer Gennady Borisov glimpsed the object moving against the pre-dawn sky from his personal observatory in Norchny, Crimea, using a telescope he had made himself. Even at the very first sight, he realized it was special. It was traveling in a different direction to the comets that inhabit the main asteroid belt that sit astride our solar system. Now the only question that remains is, are these interstellar visitors of natural origin or artificial? For that, 
We will have to take a journey to the place where they came from. Oumuamua, which means scout in Hawaiian, had come from the star system Vega. Vega is nicknamed the North Star of the past and the future. Vega is a bright star located just 25 light years from Earth, visible in the summer sky of the Northern Hemisphere. Because the Earth's axis wobbles, our perception of North gradually shifts to different stars over a 26,000 year cycle. Vega was the North Star several thousand years ago, and it will reclaim that status in about 12,000 years. In early 2013, astronomers discovered an asteroid belt surrounding Vega, suggesting the possibility of alien planets within the rock's midst. The layout suggests that there are two areas, an outer region with icy asteroids and a region closer to the star, where warmer space rocks reside. Oumuamua was one of these rocks. NASA had only 11 days to observe it as it was cruising out incredibly fast three times the speed that Earth orbits the Sun. And then, it was out of range, too small and dim to be detected. It entered our solar system, and after it flew past Earth, it suddenly accelerated on its way out of our star system. While tracking Oumuamua, we expected that it would follow a hyperbolic orbit, as though the only force acting on it would be gravitational. But it didn't. It was as though there was an additional acceleration, as though something unobserved were pushing it, in addition to the influence of gravity. Two things in particular fixated scientists. The first was its mysterious acceleration away from the sun, and the second was its peculiar shape. Over the years that followed, scientific journals and global media headlines swarmed with speculation while NASA tried very hard to categorize it as an asteroid, and then a comet, and then an asteroid, and then a comet again. It became very clear that we did not have the slightest clue of what it was. We still don't, let's be honest. Harvard astronomer Avi Loeb, however, suggested that it may be an artificial construction made by an intelligent extraterrestrial civilization. Ah, finally someone who dared to speak what was on everyone's mind. Because whatever it was, one thing is for sure. It challenged our physics and baffled everyone. After reaching its closest point to the Sun, the object began exiting the solar system at very high speed relative to our own Sun, or about 95,000 kilometers per second, more than enough to ensure it would escape our star's gravity. But, even with such a massive speed, it accelerated in a very smooth and steady manner, totally contrary to what is expected from a rough and irregular comet during outgassing of its ices. The odds of such behavior from a naturally occurring comet is highly unlikely. By October 7, 2017, it was moving toward the Pegasus constellation, heading for points unknown. By then, with today's technology, there was no possible way to catch up with and photograph Oumuamua in close proximity. Thus, the data at hand is all that we will ever have. But all of its weird attributes could have one perfect explanation. It might be an alien spacecraft with a light sail, a new study suggests. Indeed, an artificial origin would explain quite nicely the many weird characteristics of the cosmic visitor. Scientists initially regarded the object as a comet, but they reclassified it as an asteroid after observations failed to reveal a tail or fuzzy coma. Oumuamua's very discovery was something of an anomaly. Our own solar system doesn't shed any such objects. Astronomers have used the Green Bank Telescope in West Virginia and the Allen Telescope Array in Northern California to listen for any possible pings coming from Oumuamua. To date, the object has remained silent. Another such visitor, to I Borisov, has turned out to be emphatically less difficult to decipher than its cosmic companions. Much like those lingering at the outer edges of the solar system, to I Borisov is thought to have been composed of a muddy mixture of water, dust, and carbon monoxide. It had a visible tail, and was more or less what scientists were expecting. 
But, if anything, Tuai Borisov makes Omoamoa seem even weirder. Tuai Borisov is believed to have been ripped from an ancient solar system centered around a red dwarf star, the dimmest and most abundant type in our galaxy. Based on its speed and trajectory, one international team has tentatively calculated that it might have originated around a Staros 573 now a white dwarf, which inhabits a region of space around 629 trillion miles 965 trillion km away from the Sun. They suggest that it was ejected into space after the violent collision of three large objects in this celestial neighborhood around 900,000 years ago. Well, as for Oumuamua and 96B, I am not saying it was aliens, but it was aliens. Love that meme. A being from an advanced alien civilization would design a spacecraft that could hide in plain sight if they did wish to spy on us. And the only way that these could be distinguished from the millions of other asteroids and comets was only if we were able to study their trajectories and compositions up close and personal. Beyond the Blue